Hello and welcome back to Fire Emblem 7, The Blazing Blade, or Reckono Ken in Japan. When we last left off, we got a new guy, Canis. Level 8, too. So... Increases skill. Thirteen, ten, nine, thirteen, seven, six. Hella would mind. Lady Priscilla, what's the matter? You seem ill at ease. Herc, I'd like to thank you for your service. Huh? I heard you to protect me, and your contract ends today. Huh? Uh, now that you mention it, I suppose it does. But what do you plan on doing now, Lady Priscilla? I, I am in debt to Lord Elowit. I intend to follow him until his expedition is ended. Perhaps you might be able to extend my contract? No, regretfully I cannot. I left on this journey without my family's permission. Even if I were to keep you on with me, I'm afraid I would have no gold to pay you. I see. And there is nothing to be done about it. My contract with you ends now, Lady Priscilla. <sighs> well then, shall we be on our way? What? But, Urk, you... I have decided to join you on this trip, uh... to further my own training. I shall guard you, Lady Priscilla. It's part of that training. If it's not in position. Erk, of course it is no imposition. But, but then, I should think it odd. Um, perhaps you could not call me Lady? Well then, Priscilla? Yes, yes, that sounds much nicer. As you wish. Now, Erk, I'll trust you'll do your duty well. As always, Priscilla. Support level increased. A rank... Strengthens the bonds of between units by talking. Miss Bam. Thank you, ma'am. Quit it. That's, uh, that, that's enjoyable. Okay, so I don't have to worry about leaving you guys together all the time. You're being tested by pirates in passage to the Dread Island to hang in the balance? Here, use this bow. It's a rare beauty, huh? A second friend gave it to me, but I can't use it. Don't get yourself killed out there, okay? Got a short bow. Ah. 
So as long as I keep... above this line. Yeah, you might come after Florina there. Something about which I must speak to you. If I may, I really should be going. Please listen. Kent, unhand me. I am sorry, but I cannot. I let go of your hand now. I, I would regret it for the rest of my life. What? Lady Lindis, I would like to answer your question of the other day. I am here for you, even if I were not a knight, even if you were not my lady. My heart would not change. Kent. So, I hope that you'll forgive me. Should I continue to stay by your side? Yes, of course. Not as Lindis, but as Lynn. Yes, Kent. Stay by my side. Always. Yay! What an interesting diversion! Maybe we should join in. Lord Elliwood of Fairy, you don't know the fear of the Black Fang. Start grieving, for I will teach you that fear. Ow. down there. Yeah, I think it's a regular heal should be okay. in this sword here? It's called a Lance Reaver. It's an incredible sword to take against lances. Still, it's a little weak against axes. Go ahead, take it. You're gonna go to the Dread Islands, right? Wanna avoid the pirates, go behind the shop. 
there, just head straight down the alley. Good luck to you. Got the Lance Reaver. I'm moving you over there so you uh, don't get hurt. Got men's staff and uh, a lot of really good stuff, so I should consider it. this time. Oh, Silver Axis. Let's actually get the support between Hector and Florina. Uh, th thank you for saving me. D do you remember me? I'm Florina, servant of the house of Kaelin. I said it. I... I did say it, didn't I? Huey, I said it. Now if I can just... If I can say it to Lord Hector's face right now, huh? Come on, Florina, chin up. Take a deep breath. You have to speak loudly, remember? Just once more, for practice. Breathe deep. Lord Hector! Yeah? Yeah! Say, aren't you one of Lynn's? Yeah! So, sorry, beg your pardon. What was that all about? Am I some kind of monster? Huh? Oh. It's because you're unsure. You should put on deodorant. Some more level increased. But, yeah, I just want to show that off. Uh, back to where we were. One sec. Okay, 
I think we're, uh, better now. I would le leveled up to level 10, which is, uh, not bad at all. Seeing, I actually, I gave some levels too. It's level 9. Let's have you visit this house. You're a brave soul to come to such a perilous place. Here, you should have this staff. You can use it to make those whose magical resistances are weaker than your own fall asleep for a while. Whether it works or not depends on the skill of the wielder. Oh yes, looks like those pirates are bearing down on you. Maybe this staff will help you get away. Got a sleep staff. Yay. What mooncats? I would have let them sit there if they hadn't come in here closer. Up and at him, mates! Attack! This is a general store. How can I help you? Well, um... Yeah, I want one of those. Um... One's fine. Oh, yeah. And one of these. That's it. Drop in again. Well, because I got within range of some of these people, I already had people try to attack me. But, do not attack, talk. Aha! You made it, Welps! That was hard. <laughs> you give us passage now, won't you? I'm man of the sea. Always keep my word. And my old lies lying to me? Is this beauty really with you? <laughs> my lucky day. <sighs> Listen, I know how you feel, but you got to accept it. No other choice. I know that. I haven't said a word, have I? Just with your eyes. Go to the Dread Isle now. Please, Father, be well. The pirate ship. Fargus's ship sails along smoothly. Yay! At last, they spot a fog and shrouded isle on the hor horizon. Or horizon. Hellwood's father is on this isle, as is the Dragon's Gate. It's a heck of a mustache. As they draw closer to the isle, Hellwood no longer fears that his father might be one of the conspirators. Has as the moment of truth nears, Elliwood only prays that he is safe. Chapter 17. Pirate Ship. Yarr. Oh, hey, Lenny. You don't get seasick, do you? I'm fine, sir. This is a beautiful ship. <laughs> For a sea rover, eh? Might I ask you a question? What is it? Why did you agree to give us passage? <laughs> when we said that we wished to travel to Valor, the people in the harbor treated us as those we were <laughs> mad. I'm sure they did. It is the Dread Isle, after all. If not for good reason, we wouldn't want to go either. And <laughs> yet you've given us free passage. Why is that? Listen to me, laddie. Men are strange beasts. We can't resist a challenge. Something appears on the horizon, we immediately set sail. Some dreams we conquer, others we abandon. I've grown old. I haven't had a good challenge in many a year. And you moon calves appeared seeking passage of the Dread Isle. I was impressed with your courage. I think you may be the one to survive the Dread Isle. We won't disappoint you. We will return. All right, then we'll weigh anchor and wait for you. Light a signal fire when you want to return, and we'll pick you up. Thank you. Captain, there's a dory adrift to port. Looks like there's someone aboard. What are your orders? Bring him aboard. Looks like we got a visitor. Ah, though, finding a boat adrift near here. 
odd. Why is that? The sea currents in this area. Anything drifting around here must come from the Dread Isle. Oh. Shall we greet our guest? Hello, what? You done talking to the old man Fargus? You saw us? No, I heard you got off with him. You learned anything? We could trust him. We got lucky finding him. Uh, if you say so. Hey, you two, come here. They pulled the Dory aboard. I wonder who's on board. It's... it's a girl. Uh, uh... Oi! You there! Me? Give me a hand, will ya? I don't know where to, uh, grab her? Okay. Such the gentleman. Stow it! Huh? Ninian? Ninian, wake up. Unbelievable. What are the chances? Do you know her? She said Lindus and I met a year back. Rescued Ninian from a band of villains. Please let me in. Open your eyes. Uh, Ninian, can you hear me? Uh, I... Are you well? Why were you on that boat? Where's Niles? Why isn't he with you? Uh, uh, Ninian. Lindus, something's wrong with her. Who? Captain, pirate ships approaching from the northwest. Did they dare attack Captain Vargas and the Davros? They must be mad! What flag are they flying? Never seen that pattern before. These seas belong to us. Whoever they are, they're in our waters. It's a day for strange occurrences, it seems. You whelps want your own hides. We've no time to waste on ye. Whoa! Water! The hole's been breached! We're taking on water. Breach! Those scum are more dangerous than I had thought. It's bad, Captain. Need all hands below decks or we'll sink. Take care of it. I'm gonna carve these scallywags some new gizzards. We need your help! Water's up to the galley! You must come below, Captain! Yeah. Fargus, leave the enemy to us. Fighting is something we're good at. But a sinking ship? That's your affair. We have to do something. We'll all drown. We'll deal with things up here. Please, hurry. Fine, deck is yours. I'll be back as soon as we plug the breach and all. Go. Lynn, take her to that room. I will. Here they come. All we want is the girl. Kill the rest. Well. Survive. Great. That'll be it for next time. When we come back, folks, survive! Yay! Have a good one.